Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So if you are new here, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and also push that post notification bell so that way you can get notified every time I upload a brand new video. So on today's video, I thought I'd just um, bring you guys along while I get ready. Um, we are going to be going to my cousin's birthday party. Um, I don't think I'm going to record there. I may just insert some like little um, like snap clips on here, maybe towards the end. Um, but yeah, if you would like to see me get ready, then please keep watching. Alright, so I always start off my brows when I do my makeup. And then I already did apply, like, my base and stuff. Um, like my moisturizer. Oh, I forgot my primer. Just kidding. So I'm gonna apply my e.l.f. Poreless Putty Primer. This is my go-to favorite primer right now. I always start off with my brows first and I am going to be using my Anastasia brow gel in the color soft brown. Oh, I just hit my toe. So I go in, I go in with this first um, in the front of my eyebrows and like brush it up and then after I'll go in with my Anastasia dip brow pomade in the color dark brown. Um, so yeah, we're going to go ahead and speed through this. So go ahead and enjoy this little fast forward moment. Alright, so now I'm going to go ahead and clean up my eyebrows and I'm going to be using my LA Girl Pro Concealer. I'm just going to place this under my eye. And I'm going to be using my um, Jeffree Star X Morphe brush in JS7. So after I go in with my brush, I go in with my finger and just like push it in. And then I'm going to go back in with my brush. So I'm thinking about doing a cut crease eye look. Um, I'm just trying to figure out what palette to use. All right, so I'm just gonna go ahead and go into my Morphe um, Nikita palette. She looks just like that. So cute. So we're gonna go into her today. I'm going to go ahead and apply the same um, concealer onto my eyelids just as a base for my eyeshadow. I'm going to be using my Morphe um, Jaclyn Hill brush JH53 just to go ahead and blend this in. Every single memory comes back to life. 
All right, so I'm going to start off by picking up the color Seduction. It's this little brown color right there. And I'm going to be placing that color right I'm going to be placing this color right on my bone. And then just pan it out. And do a wheel windshield wiper motion or a second motion. Right, next I'm gonna go ahead and pick up the color Mama Dragon. It's this purple color right here. And I'm just gonna blend that um with this brown color right here. It's like a brown but it has like a pink undertone in it. up in that same purple color just to darken it up and the brush I'm using is a Morphe um, Jeffree Star brush I'm gonna go ahead and go uh, back into that same pinky brown color and bring that color back a little bit. So we talk about the past for a moment. I forget why we never left. And I'm gonna go ahead and do the same thing to the other eye. Alright, so now I'm going to take a small blended brush and I'm going to dip into this black colored nasty right here. I'm barely picking up a little bit of time. I don't want it too dark. So we talk 
right now I'm gonna go ahead and do the same thing to the other eye. So now I'm going to go ahead and cut my crease and I'm going to be going into my same concealer. I'm going to put some on the back of my hand right here. So yeah, I'm going to go ahead and cut my crease and I'll be right back. Alright, so I went ahead and did a high cut crease. Now I'm going to go ahead and pick up this color Nick right here. It's like a shimmery white. I'm going to be placing this color right at the inner corner of my eye. And sorry I've been a little MIA. I know I have been. Um, especially on my Instagram. I haven't been posting really um, makeup pics. Um, I actually just started working, so I've been a little busy. Um, but yeah, I, I promise you guys, I'll have some new content up ready for you. But yeah, guys, I'm going to go ahead and try to get um, more content up. Um... I've just been super busy. I did start working again, so that kind of like pushed things to the side as well. Um, but yeah, I'm going to go ahead and try to um, upload more on YouTube and Instagram and my Facebook. Um, but yeah, so go ahead and stay tuned for that. You smile, every single memory comes back to Alright, so now I'm going to go ahead and take a smaller blending brush and I'm going to go back into that first color that I had picked up. Um, that brown color with a uh, like pink undertone. So I'm going to go back into that and blend it into this first color shade that I had placed. Just to get the color and then I'll blend it after. And it's okay if I don't get it all the way to the top right here um, where my crease line is because I'm gonna, we're gonna cut it again like another crease line. gonna go back into that first color and make sure everything's blended in correctly. So just like that. Then I'm gonna go back into that purple color and I'm also going to be picking up a smaller blending brush and I'm going to be blending that purple into the brown and I'm basically just repeating the same colors I used um, earlier
right, so now I'm going to go into the color black and the color nasty. And I'm going to be using like an angled brush like this. And this is from BB um, E15 brush. Just like that. And the reason I'm using this brush is just because I need to make uh, like a line like if I were yeah, like if I were doing an eyeliner. So we're gonna go ahead and do that. Now we're just gonna like fill it in and blend it into the purple. And I'm getting a small blending brush. Ah, I dropped my brush. And I'm going to be using the smaller blending brush to blend it into the purple. And it's okay if it looks a little bit messy right here. take that same angled um, brush that I was using to clean up my eyebrows to clean this up. And then these, where that crease is right there and right here, we are going to apply some glitter there. But I'm going to go ahead and do the other side off camera and I'll be right back. Alright, so I went ahead and finished the other eye. Um, I am going to go ahead and apply this glitter now. It's um, Revlon Photo Ready Eye Art. I'm kind of running out, but this is the glitter I'm going to be using. It's a 2-in-1. This color is in Topaz Twinkle. But I'm going to be placing this color right here on the crease line. So we talk about the past for a moment. I forget why we never lasted with your hand on my knee. Every single feeling comes back to me. I 
so now that I have that line, I'm gonna go ahead and do the bottom line. Now I'm gonna go ahead and do the same thing to the other eye. So now I'm gonna go ahead and um, start doing my foundation, concealer, contour. Um. But yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and just using these clips right here to. Um, oh, oh! <gasps> Do you see what the hell I just did? I still have concealer on the back of my hand and great, great. All right, so now I'm gonna go ahead and just go with, in with my foundation. First, I'm going to be using my NARS Natural Radiant Longwear Foundation and I am in the color Sahel. Honestly, I don't even know if I said that shit right, but I don't wanna put it on the back of my hand, so I'm just gonna put it straight on my face. Oh, before that, I'm actually going to get rid of these so since now i'm working again i have to wear a mask all freaking day and it is breaking me out like uh, do you guys see that it's so freaking nasty but we're gonna go ahead and get rid of those so we're gonna just cover them up so anywhere you have like a pimple blemish dark spot um you can go in with this and I have a little one right here. And this is the Ellie Girl Pro Concealer HD High Definition Concealer. It looks just like that. And I'm just going to go ahead and take a beauty blender and I'm just going to pat this in. Not pat, just push it in. Alright, so now we're going to go into my foundation. Um, and then I'm going to go into a wet beauty blender just like this. And I'm just going to blend this in. Okay, so now I'm going to go into my KK Beauty um, contour stick. And I'm going to be using the... <sighs> Look, <laughs> this is literally all I freaking have left. I need a new one, but I love this contour stick. But we're going to go ahead and bring it all the way down. So I'm going to go ahead and draw a line here. A line there, a line like this. Then we're gonna go ahead and draw a line like that on the cheekbones, forehead, and the chin. So I draw it like kind of like a owl. So I go like this straight down and then curve it automatically just like that. I'm gonna go ahead and place this on our lip like this. I'll 
also create like a fuller lip you can like draw your whole lip line I'll just do it for the sake of the video but back into my concealer Okay, so now I'm gonna take my Alondra and Elsie BFF palette, um, and this is a snatched face palette. And I'm gonna go ahead and go into Skinny Legend right here to bronze. I'm gonna go ahead and take my um, Laura Mercier translucent powder. And make a bit. Gonna take a beauty blender. I'm gonna go ahead and leave that there for now and I'm gonna go ahead and apply um I can't find my freaking brush. I'm gonna go ahead and apply um some gel eyeliner into my waterline. I'm gonna go ahead and take this beauty blender to pull down my eye to go ahead and apply this on my waterline and then I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna do the top as well. I just kind of like look up. All right, so now I'm just gonna take um, my Morphe Jeffree Star brush JS2 and I'm just gonna like fluff all this away, like blend it away. I also forgot to do my um, bottom lash line. So I'm gonna go ahead and take the black and I'm gonna blend it underneath my lash line. Just like this. I had, after I go ahead and apply the black, I'm gonna take that same purple and blend it in. I'm just blending the purple into the black but anyways I'm thinking should I apply a white eyeliner like here right here and then the inside or no my super beauty hydra fx um hydra liner so it's literally just like I think it's powder I don't know what the fuck it is but I just put it with water, mix it, and it's good to go. At the time that you're fucking getting rid of it, I'm gonna be there at full. She said she almost. So when it dries, you can literally just like scratch it off. So I'm using this little, it's really sharp, um, to kind of like scratch the pieces off. That 
and smear it onto my lid. And I'm going to take the purple. No, my camera's going to die. I'm going to go ahead and apply eyelashes and I'll be right back. So this is my finished look. I went ahead and threw some lashes on, did some bottom mascara, and applied highlight and a lipstick. This is what I'm wearing. This crop top with some black jeans and some boots. But yeah. Alright, so I did notice right now that I'm um, editing this video for you guys. I forgot to do an outro. Um, but yeah. So if you did enjoy this video, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up down below. And also push that post notification bell. So that way you can get notified every single time that I upload a brand new video. Don't forget to follow me on all my social media accounts. I'll go ahead and list them right here. And yeah, thank you guys. Bye.